Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how I took the uh, TVS and attached it to the bottom of the decoder buddy. As far as I can tell, the bottom of the decoder buddy is going to be the better place to put the uh, TVS because it has uh, interference with a small connector board on top. First I'm going to use just a little bit of flux. I like chip quick on both the decoder buddy and the TVS. It took longer to set up the demonstration than it did to actually solder the TVS's onto the boards. It's a very easy procedure. Jeff Bunza mentioned that it's good to stabilize your uh, at least one part of your uh, project. So I decided to stabilize the decoder buddy. Take and just tin the uh, pad on the uh, bottom side of the decoder buddy. And then just like the resistors, uh, the custom resistors I showed you earlier on a, in another video, just set the uh, TVS on those two pads. They're nicely spaced. It's going to work just fine. I think they're going to set up so that uh, that TVS on the bottom of the decoder buddy isn't going to inter interfere with very much of anything. Um, the motors are curved. You're going to be using a little bit of an attachment and uh, it's going to, I think it's going to fit in there pretty well. You notice on that first solder joint, I just didn't spend very much time. And about this amount of time right here, stop, would have been fine. Now I'm going to do it wrong for you. And I'm going to really heat that TVS up. That's good right there. It's solid. Um, if I stick around too long, it heats that uh, heats the TVS up too much. And what's going to happen is that's still molten solder in there. It's not solid. So if you stick around too long with your soldering iron, it's going to cause a problem. That should be solid now. Yep, that's good. Just a quick pop of, uh, of heat's going to do it. And now, just to show you that uh, the two motor leads can go on top, and they'll just get tacked on top. It's not a big deal, just, uh, just the way we usually do that. And add a little bit of flux, and we're going to uh, just touch that uh, solder to the pad tin it up again and uh, it, it'll leave the uh, TVS on the bottom uh, solid so that it's not a problem. You can see now if you went in there for about that same amount of time that uh, you could tack, uh, tack the motor wires onto, onto their proper, onto their proper uh, pads. And the TVS just crosses the pads on the bottom. That's all there is to it. Hope this helps. Uh, I think I'm finished for the night and we'll publish this for you and let you go on your merry way. I think it's going to be a good, a, a good deal for guys in clubs. Have a good.